Okay guys, these two are the apple chew sticks. And this one is the, I don't know, she gave it to me for free. But they seem to really like it. But I'm going to see if they like the apple. But the amount that are in a bag for the apple for one pound is a lot. So I can definitely afford to give them three or four sticks at a time now. Whereas before I could only give them two per day because a package was only 12 pieces. You know, I was going through like about $20 of chew sticks a month at that rate. So let's see what he likes. That's the apple one. You like the apple? Yeah, you like apple? This be the one an apple? Mmm, fresh, real apple. Real ones. Those aren't the fake ones. Not the ones you get at PetSmart. Baby girl. So anyway, there's a ton of chew toys. Um, mm, Nala's putting on a show. This is how we chew these sticks. Mm -mm -mm. Okay, so this is the free one, whatever it is. It's the nice, thick, free one. Um, Speedo's uh, trying to choose which one to chew. He looks very all business when he's chewing. <laughs> oh, 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 are we going to fight over them? <laughs> I'm so glad this stuff came. Let's see if Speedo wants food. Give it a smell. It's new. Are you hungry? Does that please you, my love? <laughs> well, I'll leave it upstairs for when you are ready. You just don't know what to play with first. <laughs> Well, I'm happy. I'm so happy the food arrived. Um, like the lady said, though, they usually eat more and more active at night, so I may not see much eating behavior until later. But, um... <laughs> Are you happy? <gasps> Look at him. Are you happy? He's feeling much better. I think he's healing very nicely. Um, <laughs> okay, Nala likes the apple. Mmm. Tasty, tasty. They actually eat this stuff. They eat the bark and shred the stick. That's what I figured out. You going back inside? Go home now? Um, and I don't know if I showed you guys yesterday, because Speedo, I was worried he wouldn't climb upstairs, even on the ramp. Um, I figured out what they like. They like the rose hip, actually. They like the crushed ones, because I put a ton of it in here. Um, so basically, there's rose hip, dandelion leaf, and rosemary, I think. Um, so I just mixed it into one little dish to see what they would eat instead of giving it to them piece by piece. Plus, I'm also still afraid they'll bite my finger if it's too small. So, I put it in there. And there's just a treat in here. Um, I just don't want them to walk and pee all over it. So, I'll just put them in there. How about that? <gasps> see, he's playing. He's feeling better. He, the last couple of days, I gave him a lava bite. He didn't even want to look at me. Alright, guys. That's all for now. We'll leave them to their chewing, nibbling. Good go. Can't wait till the tenactin arrives. We can start treating your nose, you poor girl. Nala's losing some fur on her nose. It's very obvious there's something wrong now. Um, even if the breeder hadn't told me, I would definitely know that it's starting to progress again. Uh, for a brief while, uh, maybe day three or four when I first noticed, uh, I noticed it seemed to stop. But I guess it was spreading underneath the bottom of her nose. It's all around now. Um, so, I don't know what he's doing. What are you doing, baby? That's weird. Look at him. He's scratching like he's sandbathing. <gasps> oh, you poor thing. Do you want a sand bath? Oh, I'll give you one very soon, baby. I promise. As soon as those two weeks are up, you will get a sand bath. Along with Nala, now that I can catch her with a glove, you can have one together. Okay, baby? All right, I gotta go, guys.